Hey everyone, it's Ashley Mayu with the Daily Racing Forum. I have a Coast to Coast ticket for this Saturday, April 1st. We'll quickly go through the sequence. A lot of great races. Gets kicked off at Gulfstream Park in their 12th race. The Grade 2 Gulfstream Park Oaks, Mal and a 16th on the dirt. Thought it was wide open. I thought the 4, 5, and 8 were all logicals. The 8, Darth Vader, huge upset last time out in the Devona Dale. The 5, Miracle, raced very well last time out at the fairgrounds. And the 4, Affirmative Lady, she's held her own in stakes competition in the past. We stay at Gulfstream Park for their 13th race. It's the Appleton at a mile on the grass. Wide open race. You either have to spread or go light. I went light. I used the 3, Grace Fable as my long shot in here at 10 to 1. And the sixth steady on, who I have a feeling will be the post time favorite. We'll move to Santa Anita Park for their sixth race. It's a $10,000 claiming event going five and a half furlongs on the dirt. It's an unreliable bunch of horses. A lot of horses need to step it up. Just use two runners in here, the five and the six. The six did have a win last year, and I thought the five ran very well last time out. We'll go to the Florida Derby, race number 14 at Gulfstream Park, Mellon and eighth on the dirt. Big field. All eyes on Forte. Do you single? Do you try to beat him? I do use him. I thought post 11, though, was a bit concerning. So I also use the number four in here, Mage. And then to run, wrap up things, excuse me, the wrap up in the grade two Royal Heroine, race number seven at Santa Anita. Use the two Honey Jars, my top pick, as well as the Morning Line favorite, the number three, Closing Remarks. So $48 ticket for me this Saturday. Good luck if you're playing.